Well, Adam, obviously ahead of tomorrow's game. It's the last home game of the season, but we reflect on Tuesday night and a point gained. Yeah, most definitely a point gained. Um, frustrating game, if I'm being honest, but it was a game that we um, we kind of knew what it would look like, and I think it was always going to be about if we could break um, a very organised team down. Uh, they, they've had a lot of football, and um, we knew that they'd they'd kind of be be stuck in the shape and we'd have to move it. And on the night, I didn't think we, we did enough to do that, but um, really hard-earned point. And like I said after the game, I think to, to be disappointed with a point away from home shows how far the group's come. Um, back in training today, obviously, ahead of tomorrow. How the squad looked? We look good. Boys look lively. We look sharp. Um, we, I think we got a real good balance between our, our work and our, our rest at the minute. So... Um, the boys are fresh, ready to go. Uh, it's an, another big game for us, but the, the good thing with this group now is that they've been playing under pressure for a long time, so they're used to it, they're handling it. Um, we, we've really stepped up in terms of our mentality, and, and it's a credit to the, the players for that. They've they've adopted a winning attitude, um, and we're going to need that tomorrow. And tomorrow we welcome the Chippenham side, who until recently were in with a shout of the playoffs. Yeah, really good team, really, really good team. I think probably... Apart from from watching us, they're, they're my favourite team to watch. I think they, you can tell, they're well coached. They've got a, a a real philosophy, a clear philosophy, and and one they stick to. Um, and for me, that's something I really respect. So I have bad beliefs and, and have strong beliefs like that, and um, and be be willing to carry it out at all costs. Um, I think that that takes a lot of courage from a coach and a manager. So uh, a team I've got a lot of respect for. Uh, a game we're looking forward to. It'll be a tough game. Um, but as always, we'll, we'll focus on us and, and what we do. And say going into the game in sort of good form with one defeat in the last eight games. What's what do you put that turnaround down to? The players. I think the players have uh, been outstanding. Um, they they've bought into everything we've asked of them. We, we've we've tried to change the mindset in the group, and I think we're we're seeing that now. Uh, I've seen y- young men become men. Um, there's a real grit and desire in the in the group to, to try and get this challenge over the line. Um, and we, we do believe at the minute if we're on our game, we, we'll give anybody a game in this league, um, whether it's bottom of the league or top of the league. So confidence is high. Um, we know we have to be at our max to, to win football matches in this league. We, we can't afford to turn up and, and be at 70%. We, we've got a week of, of football left and, and we'll be giving it everything we can to, to get as many points on the board as we possibly can. And say so the challenge continues tomorrow, the last home game, how important will that support be? Oh, it'll be huge. It's been amazing for us. Um, even when I weren't here, I know the support was great, but since I've come in, I've said it a number of times, that the support for for what we're doing has been outstanding. Um, it's been one of my biggest pleasant surprises since I came into the football club of not just how big the support is, but how passionate it is. We, we've got a real um, age difference as well in our support. So we've got guys that have been here for 20, 30 years and, and, and seen a lot to the new guys that are coming in at five and six and making a lot of noise. So uh, it's something we want to grow. It, it's something I'm really keen to grow. Um, everything we do, whether it's in, in tough times like we've been in this season or hopefully more positive times in the future, we need to do together and um, we're going to need everybody tomorrow to, to make a big push. Thank you, mate.